Hey everybody, it's Steve with Getting Fresh Air, and today we're here with a different style video for you. We're going to look at a piece of new gear that we got for the Jeep and uh, talk about it a little bit here. So, if you look at this, we've always talked about this area here above uh, the back seat is a dead space. So we found this Gear Spot G2 bag with gear hammock here uh, the, at, at the Smoky Mountain Jeep Invasion. Uh, we got it installed, but we're going to back up the video a little bit here and do an unbagging and show you how we got it installed. Hey guys, this is Kelly. Today we're going to be unpackaging the GearSpot G2. Inside the packaging you have an instruction sheet with a QR code that you can scan to watch an instruction video on YouTube. You have six bungees, the gear net, and the bag itself. In the bag itself, you have three zippers on the front of it that gives you access to the compartments. These compartments are sectioned off, so when you're driving around, the stuff doesn't slide from compartment to compartment. And then on the end, you have separate zippers on each end that give you access to the, from each side. Now let's take it over to the Jeep and get it installed. The install of the bag is really simple. There's two straps on both the driver and passenger side rails, and then two straps that goes over the center speaker rail. So here's the bag nicely tucked up in that space. You can see if you have maybe taller kids or adults in the back that it may be a head interference there, but with our dogs or smaller kids, it's gonna be fine. Zippers to access the three compartments are on the back side of the bag or the two outboard compartments also have zippers on the outside so you can access those compartments from outside the vehicle. There's also Velcro by each of the openings so you can either put a patch up there like the flag shown or maybe some gear markers so you know what's in each pocket. Installing the gear hammock is just as simple as we just had with the bag. The gear hammock installs with six bungee cords that just wrap around the straps from the bag and hangs on the underside of the bag. We're going to play around with this setup, but we're pretty excited for this. We think when in the compartments themselves, some lightweight uh, recovery gear like soft shackles and stuff, maybe some gloves or rain jackets uh, once it gets cooler weather, heavier jackets and underneath the net, some of that stuff that you use all the time, the dog's leashes, all of our camera gear, tripods, all that type of stuff that we'll have quick access as we're making these videos. We'll use this for a few months out on the trail, camping, overlanding, and then we'll come up and do a second video, kind of a review and our thoughts on the overall product. The gear spot bag comes in two models, the G1 and G2, and here's a list of which Jeep models each works with. You can also go and check out their website at thegearspot.com. All right, that's it for today. We hope you enjoy this gear spotlight, and we'll see you out there getting fresh air.